That's the person who has been known by the, the, the police, in, uh, Canadian police, uh, is related to a multitude of uh, events. Uh, with violence. Montreal police have made an arrest in the killing of Claudia Yacono, the daughter-in-law of late mobster Moreno Gallo. On May 16th, 39-year-old Yacono was fatally shot in the parking lot outside the salon she owned in Cote des Neiges. SPVM say they arrested a 28-year-old Tuesday in Milton, Ontario, near Toronto. Joel Richard Clark facing a charge of first-degree murder. We have uh, all the information linked to this man. And we have the reason wrong to believe that he was in Ontario, so we contact the Ontario to uh, have support and they give us a good support. And that's why we were able to arrest the guy yesterday and uh, he's appeared today for, mur for murder. This comes just days after another high-profile mafia-linked murder. On Monday, 53-year-old Francesco Del Balso was shot and killed in Dorval outside of a gym. He was allegedly said to be the prime suspect in the attempted murder of Leonardo Rizzuto, reportedly the head of the Montreal Mafia. He was shot at in Laval while driving on the highway in March. Police say they can't confirm a link between Yakono's murder and the mafia and don't yet know the motive for the killing. Pretty difficult to say it's the mafia, but uh, Miss Yakono, you probably heard about what, what's going on, you know, so it's impossible to me that it's related to the mafia, but for sure the guy, uh, if it's accused of murder, first, uh, first degree murder, it's because you want to do something to her or other person around it. Yakono's father-in-law was gunned down in Mexico in November 2013. The SPVM says this is the first phase of their investigation and aren't ruling out making more arrests in this case. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.